just a short distance away from the hustle and bustle of downtown Banff Avenue lives an endangered species you've probably never heard of before, the Banff Springs snail. To call them the grizzly bears of the hot springs. And that's because just like grizzly bears can tell you about the health of a large ecosystem, say for instance the, the Rocky Mountains, these snails tell you about the ecological integrity, the health of this very small scale ecosystem. It's uh, Dr. Dwayne Lipitsky. I'm a conservation biologist. Been on contract with Parks Canada for the past 15 years to work on the Bant Spring Snail. It's found nowhere else in the world except here at, the, uh, at a number of springs on Sulphur Mountain in Banff National Park. So what we're looking at is the Kidney Spring here on Sulphur Mountain. And for the second known instance, this spring is now dry, so we have no thermal water flowing. As a consequence of that, this snail population, which we re-established in 2003, has most likely gone extinct. And then when we went into Middle Springs, the, the Upper Middle Springs, which we showed you, was one of the other re-established populations. That population also had gone extinct. So you think a snail is quite, um, quite simple, but it's not. The more and more we look into it, and that's one of the values of this long-term monitoring, the more questions we have. When, it, when any species goes extinct, it's a, it's a sad loss to biodiversity. And if people and humans are the cause of that ultimate extinction, then I think it's a really sad story.